what we're going to do today is we're going to help you figure out the best way to get rid of your leftover Twinkies. We're going to call this episode Death of Twinkie. That sound like a good thing? I think that sounds like a so, wonderful thing. So we're going to bring some grandkids in now. We're going to get some suggestions on how to kill a Twinkie, and we're going to show you the best way to do it. Okay, here for the first one, I've got my oldest grandson, Nathan. Say hello, Nathan. Hello, Nathan. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, anyway, uh, his suggestion was to try and use radiation in a, in a safe, controlled environment, correct? Yes. And how did you suggest we do that? I suggested we put a Twinkie in the microwave. Twinkie in the microwave. So here we are. We're going to take a Twinkie and we're going to put it in the microwave. Why yes. don't you go ahead and get that unwrapped and we'll move over to the microwave. Okay, here we have our standard issue microwave, microwave safe plate, and one unwrapped Twinkie. Nathan, I'll let you take that. This what? is definitely one of those things you should not try at home. Well, this isn't my home. <laughs> Great. We're <laughs> golden. Okay. Pop it in there, and we'll lock it in. How much time do you think it's going to take to successfully kill a Twinkie? Let's try five minutes. Five minutes. Okay, set the timer for five minutes, and we'll be ready to go. Looks like it's uh, holding its own right now. Yep. No major changes. Not so far, anyways. Hasn't exploded. Which we want to it for it to explode. It's kind of hard to see through this uh, glass on the camera, but uh, we'll just keep watching it. Is that a little brown spot getting bigger? Yes. Hmm. Something tells us it's going to explode soon. If you look real close, I can see some smoke coming off the Twinkie in it, the microwave. Yep. And this will not cause a fire, so do not panic if you guys ever do try this. Well, it might cause a fire, but it's okay. We've got a fire extinguisher right here. <laughs> wow, that is... Look at the smoke is just billowing out of there. We can no longer... Okay. We have got a definite burnt Twinkie smell going on. Yep, definitely. Okay, we're only at a minute and a half, so let's take it right down to three minutes... We're going to hear a smoke detector go off pretty soon. Uh, Nathan, why don't you go ahead and hit cancel and open the door and let's see what it looks like. Open the door. Woo! Oh, yeah. Yeah, that is a... Uh, <laughs> ooh. ooh, man. That is a bad smell. Yeah. Look dead to you? Yep, definitely. I don't think I could see a burnt Twinkie moving as that. All right, well, you definitely don't want to eat it anymore, so... Uh, yep. Cooking Twinkies in a microwave is certainly one way to kill them, <laughs> wouldn't you say? Yes, definitely. All right. We're back. I'm here with my youngest granddaughter here today, Caitlin. Say hello. Hi, guys. Caitlin, how old are you? Eight. In eight years, have you ever tried to kill a Twinkie? No. What was your suggestion today on how we kill a Twinkie? Well, mine is to boil it. Boil it. So what we've done is we've got a pan of nice boiling water. I mean, that's really, really boiling. And we're going to take this Twinkie and we're just going to drop it right in. Okay, Caitlin, we're going to take one of these Twinkies. We're, you think we should unwrap it first? Yes. Okay, why don't you grab that unwrapped Twinkie right there and very safely hold it above the stove and just drop it right in. Okay, it's just kind of floating around right now. There's not much going on with it. You think we should stir it up a little? Maybe we should grab a spoon and stir it. Yep. Okay, hold on. Oh, oh, wait. It's getting awful white. There's something happening. Is it getting bigger, Caitlin? Yes. It's not going to explode, is it? Maybe. Okay, well we've got a pretty good... Oh, oh, that's like... Oh, that's that's uh, disintegrating. Um, uh, uh, what do you think? It's going to melt. You think it's going to melt? Yes. 
What do you think it's going to look like when it's done? You think there'll be anything mush. left of it? Mush. Have you ever eaten Twinkie mush before? No. Do you want to try Twinkie mush today? Yes. I don't. <laughs> Here, reach in very carefully and just stir that a little. Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh, this, this is some pretty gross looking Twinkie soup. Okay, let's let it set for a minute. Now, if I just showed you that pan, would you know that there was a Twinkie in there ever? No. No. Okay, well our Twinkie soup is about to boil over. It's like it's growing. It's like a Twinkie zombie. It's just growing and it just won't die. Okay, we've tamed it back down. Now we're going to shut off the heat and we're going to see if there's anything left that can even be recognized. Nothing. Okay, I would have to say that boiling a Twinkie is a pretty effective way of making it disappear. What do you think? Yes. So was this a success? Yes. All right. Very good. Hello, I'm back, and we're still trying to kill Twinkies. I'm here this time with Natasha. Say hello. Hello. Natasha, what was your idea on how to kill a Twinkie? Smashing it. Smashing it. Okay, does that sound safe? Don't try this at home. It's okay. Don't try this at home. I'm not at home. I'm at the neighbor's <laughs> house. <laughs> Don't tell them. Shh. Okay, so just, you know, another thing we should do, just to be safe, before we, here, safety goggles. Always a good idea when you're smashing uh, Twinkies. So, Natasha, if you will just put that Twinkie down right there in the center of that board. Thank you very much. Okay. Um, what we're going to use to smash this Twinkie, not a hammer, no. I'm going to use this sledgehammer. So keep your eye on the Twinkie. Uh, <laughs> we are standing in, Natasha, I believe what we call the splash zone. Yeah. That means that you may get cream on your shoes and ankles, okay? <laughs> but don't worry, it's, it's, it's okay. Here we go. Hit number one with a sledgehammer. I don't think that did it. No. It still looks like it's alive to me. Yeah. Okay, let's try this again. Let's get a new Twinkie. Okay, we're back with another Twinkie. Natasha? I'm gonna put it in the center of the board and you could smash it, Grandpa. Okay. Everyone clear? This time, I'm going to use a, a ground tamper. This has a much bigger surface area. Should be a lot easier to kill a Twinkie with. <laughs> you want to give me a countdown? Three? Three, two, one, smash! Oh, I don't know. I think it... Oh! oh. <laughs> yeah. Um... Yeah, I think it's dead. What do you think? Yeah, I think it is. I don't think anyone's going to eat it now. How about you? Oh, nobody's going to eat it. Okay, we'll call that a success. Okay, I'm back again. This time I'm here with... Natalie. Natalie is my oldest granddaughter. Say hello, Matea. She might be watching. <laughs> hello, Matea. Okay, we're back again. We're going to kill another Twinkie. Natalie, what was your suggestion on how we could kill a Twinkie? Burning a Twinkie. Burning a Twinkie. That's why we're outside, not inside, because you may have seen what happened with the smoke from the microwave. So Something may happen. Something may happen. Safety first, right? Yes. Okay. I'm going to wear glasses. Safety glasses. Put on our safety glasses. And then safety gloves. Safety glasses. And then we'll put on gloves. Okay. We've designated a Twinkie burning pole. If you will install the Twinkie on the Twinkie burning pole... Just slide it right down there, a little farther. Right there. All right. That looks good. Okay. I'm going to get the Twinkie flame going here. And we are going to roast a Twinkie. Just like a marshmallow. It's got a nice but bright orange color. But you're using color. a Twinkie instead. It really is burning. Yeah, um, don't do this at home. It's a bad idea. Now, is that Twinkie actually burning on its own? Oh, almost. It'll... 
So you know, I bet you if we somewhat. get it going a little bit more, it'll just burn all on its own. Yep. What do you think, Natalie? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's dead. Yeah, it's looking dead. Okay. It that died. Is, that is one dead looking Twinkie. Yes, I say. So do you think burning one is a successful way to kill a Twinkie? Yes. Definitely past its expiration date now. Are you guys done with this? Yes. Hmm. After all the grandkids have done this, um, I thought it was my turn. Um, my way to kill a Twinkie is with my lawnmower. You ready? Dead. It's dead. But it still tastes good. <laughs>